the first step to everything is self belief the confidence in self to know that your plan to succeed is possible and that is plan a there is no plan b plan b even if you make it should be another way to reach plan a what is your plan a to crack jee -E. in this video i'm going to share with you eight ways that you can crack it and you can crack it good and you can be happy cracking it and you can be proud cracking it and it's easy for you to crack it these eight methods the first of everything is commitment what are you committed to when you're giving your je examination you have to be committed to the thin the thick the rain the storm to the summer to the winter you have to be committed to everything from heartaches to heartbreaks and to all the journeys which which you will embark when you are on this journey of jee -E. commitment is key one are you committed are you committed to practice through the tutorials through the practicals through everything to traffics to the rains through long college hours are you committed to do that through everything that you have through assignments through homework through numericals commitment is key without commitment nothing is possible i want you to remind yourself about this i want you to think about this and no commitment nahi to kuch nahi and this is what you have to remember ek bar aapne apne aap se agar commitment kiya to you should not change that and that should be the key focus area commitment and the second is to promote a positive mindset to know that your mindset is everything you work it in the mind and in the reality things change to begin your day and to begin every moment by setting an intent what is your intent for the next 1 hour when you wake up in the morning what is your intent and that will take you to know what are the things that you want and what are the things that you don't want so you know now ye chahiye ye nahi chahiye who are the people you want to associate with who are these people who encourages this positive mindset in you who are these very people? people who helps you who supports you who encourages you now what doesn't fit in this bracket of your intent of the things that you want and the people that care for you everything else has to be negated has to be deleted has to be thrown out from your life so now you're left with this positive mindset this promoting yourself into this great arena which is encouragement which is positivity and that intent which you will set for yourself every moment every day throughout the third thing is to take action to your commitment we have taken the commitment we have decided certain things we have an intent now now is the time to take the action to take the action to sit for that extra number of hours to take the action to read that book to take the action to solve that numerical to take action if you do not take action nothing comes out if you don't take the action then trust me nothing comes out the outcome is going to be sad as before you will stay back and you will complain and you will be anxious and you will be worried because you've not taking those actions take actions if you don't do anything nothing will happen if you do something something will happen so how about doing that which is important to you take the right action which is aligned to your commitment which is aligned to your intention which is aligned to your goals the fourth on the list is self care the commitment to honor yourself to love yourself to hug yourself to to do things which your body needs sleep is important hydration is important the right qualitative food is important rest is important meditation is important exercise is important all of this put together when you work you have got your body aligned to yourself now you can focus better now you are alert now you are smart now your recallability is better unless you practice self care doesn't matter what else you practice you will fail because your body will fail you your body will fail you because you have failed your body promote self care make sure you drink sufficient water make sure you have the right amount of micronutrients and the macronutrients begin your day with a good prayer end your day with gratitude exercise well practice self care self care is so important you cannot be telling me that you don't have time you have the time if you make it if you're committed to these basic disciplines of self care trust me time expands it will accommodate everything that you want in that space practice self care the fifth is the notes you will have a lot of reference books a lot of 
notes that you can take from your coaching class, from your friends, from the la It's not in the quantity. The quantity is useless if you don't have the quality. It's not in this much. It's in the right quantity. You should be having the notes for yourself. Chunk it down. Make it in the lowest common denominator, which is worth digesting, which you can not only digest, but you can you can assimilate it and you can keep it and you can recall it. Have the right mind map have the right markings know the questions which has come in the past have a prediction list what can come what has the probability of coming know what has never come and what will never come know what is important know what are conceptually good or ye sab cheez ka marking hona chahiye jab tak notes sahi nahi hai aap kitna bhi mehnat karo kya fayda na you will be reading anything anywhere टेक्स्ट बुक्स का मार्किंग सही होना चाहिए कॉन्सेप्ट पता होना चाहिए द न्यूमेरिकल शुड बी सॉल्व वेल द इक्वेशन और डायग्राम्स और वट एवर इज देयर इट शुड ऑल बी देयर इन वन स्पॉट सो दैट ड्यूरिंग द टाइम ऑफ द एग्जामिनेशन और जस्ट बिफोर द एग्जामिनेशन यू हैव अ स्पॉट वे यू कैन गो एंड रेफर एंड यू कैन गेट ऑल ऑफ दैट The sixth on my list is time management. But here's the tricky thing: you should know that time cannot be managed. You cannot manage time. Here's what you can do: you can manage tasks. manage your tasks well and stay committed to the task when you get up in the morning tell yourself what are the tasks you want to complete by the end of the day and make sure that you complete these tasks it's good to have ambitious lists but make sure they are not over ambitious that it puts a strain on your shoulders and your backbone and at the end of the day you're tired and you're frustrated start small achieve it right and repeat it remember the most successful people have started young started good started in small chunk size which is easy to achieve the journey of a thousand miles begins with one step so take that one step manage your task what are the tasks that you can do you can probably tell yourself that by today end of the day i will finish 30 mcqs i will finish five numericals or i'll finish something else and dekho din ke end tak wo khatam hota hai kya it is important and that's the way you manage tasks it's not time that you need to manage it's the tasks that you need to manage and the trick is simple practice 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 the best things that you want to achieve comes with practice and therefore practice and practice to practice and practice right so remember it's not the time it's the task have a task list with you and keep checking it off as and when you finish it add new things on the list and make sure that you are a successful task planner for yourself and at the end of the day when you sleep sleep satisfied sleep with gratitude because you've achieved those tasks and achieved those tasks and achieved them right the seventh is to focus right to have a laser sharp focus and you can concentrate there it's not important that you do all of them across the wide spectrum it's important that you narrow your focus and know what is important friendship exercise friends ye wo aisa waisa ye sab rahega lekin in this moment what do you want to do there's a time for friendship and there's a time for something else and there's a time for something else but right now in this moment what do you want to do and whenever you do whatever you do bring your entire self to it bring your entire focus and concentrate there make a systematic 20 minute study time 20 minutes take a break study 20 minutes take a break study 20 minutes take a break in that way you can bring the best of yourself to the field when you study focus well concentrate well when you're doing something do that thing nothing other than that nothing other than that only that that and alone that and if you can do that for 20 minutes without interval without break without distra distraction without disturbance without anything trust me you've gathered that and you've got it right take a break now and do it again and do it again and do it again practice well this focus and concentration for 7 hours a day for 8 hours a day but start small start with 3 hours start with 4 hours and then begin to expand but do that regularly focus is important what you bring to your concentration is important the last on my list is to have the right mentor the dronacharya is important do you have the right mentor the right mentor when you're down in physics the right mentor when you need assistance in chemistry or biology the right mentor when you're emotionally down when you need some kind of backup push motivation 
A mentor is therefore very important. Sometimes you need a mentor to push you really hard, but sometimes you need a mentor who can only listen to you. Sometimes you may, you may need a mentor to help you at areas where you want help. And sometimes you want to just go to the mentor and say, I'm blank, take me through this. A mentor for different aspects. Do you have this with you? Sometimes they could be just teachers and sometimes they could be seniors who are successful. Sometimes they could just be an online help. But for you to have this list, so at times when you're down and low and thrashed, you know where to go and you're not searching at that time. So well, these were my eight top things that I feel you should be having with you in the right intensity, in the right proportion, in the right concentration if you want to crack your JEE examination. And well, you must have also seen the video in which I have put up all the latest changes which has been come moving from the CBSE to the NTA examination. Once you listen to this video, make sure you put in your best, put in your best, that single most important goal to clear this in the very first attempt. What a proud moment that would be for you. How satisfied would you be when you know that you are clearing this in the very first attempt? Not just clearing it, but getting into your desired college in the very first attempt. How proud would you be now? Isn't that great? Write to me and tell me how did you like these eight points? Would there be something else other than these eight points which are important according to you? You can ask me your questions down here or you know you can chat with me even on Instagram. All the best, do well and become the best engineers from the best universities and colleges across the country. Make us proud.